Gonna start the video with the setup here. I have, you know, the dual subwoofer BP1204, uh, two 12 inch subs, and a bandpass box. You know, everyone everyone says they're cheap. I don't know. I think in this video I'm gonna show how people just over exaggerate for no good reason. Because these subwoofers are pretty good for a first time subwoofer. I got them used off Craigslist with this SSL Soundstar lamp, I think. It's a 1000 watt bridgeable amplifier, two channel. Uh, I have I've been running these for a while and I don't have any issues. I'm it's my first level for setup, but I don't think it's that bad. People kind of hate on this for no good reason. People think it's too cheap, and but if you're just trying to get some bass going in your car, it's a pretty good setup. So in here I have the Sony CDX G3100 UP head unit. I'll show how that's important in a few minutes. I have JVC driven five and a quarter speakers in each front door. I have the stock uh, tweeters in there. I think they're about to blow out. Cause I just left them plugged in because they still worked when I got these doors apart. I have JVC 6x9s in the back shelf. Also driven. Like 30 bucks a speaker pair. Pretty good deal, good reviews and all that. And so, I found throughout my few months I've had listening to the system is that you can't just say that more some subwoofers are better for one genre than another because as I find out it's really dependent on the sound quality of the recording that you have so for instance there's a bunch of different settings on this and I have to change them I found after all each CD not all of them have the right sound settings with different subwoofer levels I have subwoofer level it depends because like, recently I've had it at zero and that's been like over bearing amounts of bass compared to the rest of the song and that's not been very good but other songs you know I turn up to two because there's just no bass in the recording and then another part of this setup is the mega bass you have that on or off that it doesn't really just like go up to number three on the subwoofer setting level it's more like it tries to make the door speakers go a little bit more bass because even if you have the subwoofer sound down to like negative two you can hear that mega bass does weird stuff with the speakers in the door 